guess what park? Epcot. <laughs> we cannot stay away. We are back today for more Festival of the Arts, some more food, and right now we are walking up and seeing one of the entertainment acts that we really wanted to see. Defying gravity and oh my goodness, I don't even know how they did that. That was incredible. So okay, now we are heading back into the festival here. We want to get some food. They were animatronics. Yeah. That's how all really that happened. <laughs> That's like the only thing that explains it. Yeah. So yes, now we're heading into World Showcase here. We're gonna see what we get up to. We're all pretty hungry. Uh, we're gonna get food. Oh look, Minnie's out doing a meet and greet. There's Minnie over there. So when we came in here today, we rode Spaceship Earth and we rode on Figment. And what happened, Mom, when we rode on Spaceship Earth? I had a very exciting moment. What have I always done for years? I always, whenever you have to pick your location, I always say, instead of saying that I was from Pennsylvania, I always said I was from Florida, because in my head, like, that's where I truly belong. This is the first time you And you turned to me and you were like, <laughs> you're legit this time. Like, I actually can mark on there that I'm from Florida. That, that was a little moment. Yes, you start to have like all these little moments that everything sinks in. <laughs> So we're taking our lap around World Showcase here, and this is actually, so it's Monday of the opening weekend of the festival, and it is Martin Luther King Day today, so a lot of people have off, and it is definitely crowded in here. So we wanted to try that booth that's back over there. I forget what it's called, it's like Viva the something. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it, but that booth that's part of Festival of the Arts, but it also had a very long line, so I think we might just, we're very hungry, like I said, I think we might do an Epcot quick service. So either maybe France, possibly fish and chips in England. We're gonna see. <laughs> We decided on some fish and chips from England here, and it has been forever since we've had these. It's been a while. I guess the last time we actually sat in inside at the restaurant. Yes, at Rose and Crown. And, um, that was the last time I had it, but not from the quick service. I forgot how big delicious. they are. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I have all the vinegar. I love malt vinegar so much. So I said, I was like, I need all the vinegar they have up there. I can't wait for this. Right, we'll make it work. <laughs> Okay, the fish and chips, those were thumbs up. They were very they were good. so good. Very delicious. Very delicious. Now, we are actually going to head out of Epcot. We're in line for the Skyliner right now. We're going to go over to Hollywood Studios because we realized that one night when we did our resort hopping and we ended up going to Caribbean right. Beach, we kind of intended, we're like, oh, maybe we'll hit studios, but then we ended up just doing resort hopping and eating over there, and so we've never gotten there. This whole trip that we've been here, we haven't gotten there yet. Also haven't gotten to Animal Kingdom yet either. I don't know if we'll have time for that. Yeah, that's uh, probably not Next gonna time you Next guys time. come back, but I'll get to go. I, I live here, so I'll do that. But we're going to Hollywood Studios right now. Wow. 
little green aliens are like, this is the way to Hollywood Studios. <laughs> We got another unwrapped one. That's like such a win. We're here. Okay, we just got to Hollywood Studios. I'm excited. Like I said, this is my first time in Hollywood Studios as a Floridian. There we go. We're starting that again. <laughs> my first time doing this as a Floridian. Here we go. First time at Hollywood Studios as a Floridian. <laughs> Right now we are rushing to go see, um, we made it just in time for the Beauty and the Beast stage show, which I have not seen this, in three minutes, let's go people. I have not seen this since it came back. And it is now like a, I don't wanna say like modified, well it is like modified because they can't be, the performers can't be like as close together on the stage. So I'm excited to see it. I just, I'm so happy that live entertainment is coming back in so many different capacities here across property. So we're gonna go see Beauty and the Beast. Then we can try Indiana Jones is back. Yes. And we haven't seen that of course in years now. So. Yeah, <laughs> that's gonna be so exciting. That one, Indiana Jones literally just came back in December. It was like just sometime in like December. Month, it was like yeah. last month, yeah. So very exciting. We have a lot of things to experience here at Hollywood Studios that we have not done in a very long time. I just love these palm trees here at Studios. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's crazy to think last time that I saw this was like 2019, maybe even before then. So happy. Well, it sounds like it's just starting. We'll be able to get a spot.
shopping so we have about a half hour until our next new or not new returning show we're gonna see Indiana Jones and that's in like a half hour so right now we're gonna do some shopping here at Hollywood Studios on Hollywood Boulevard or is that no this is Sunset Boulevard I always get that mixed up Sunset Boulevard oh this store is the one that was recently updated not too long ago look at it so pretty that's when they have the lounge fly with the Mickey waffle. This is the newest like lounge fly collection. They also have a spirit jersey that is the Mickey waffles and it is apparently scented to smell like Mickey waffles, which is very intriguing. I want to like just find it to sniff it. They're like real soft on the inside. They're like stitched jogger pants. And I just love like, it's very tropical print. Oh my goodness, look at this. So this is all the jewelry in here. Just look at that chandelier though. Oh wow. They did such a pretty remodel in here. This is seriously, like, okay. One of my favorite window displays. I'm always passionate with how they do their window displays. But this is, okay, right here. This is now Hollywood Boulevard when you first come into the park. Right here, they have these windows made up to look like Skyliner cars and people inside the mannequins are inside and they have like an actual digital video back there with the skyliner wrap that is so so cute mickey's in there doing the character meal oh my goodness he's dancing around too what hollywood <laughs> yeah oh my goodness it's crazy last time i was here there was a big christmas tree in the middle like we keep saying you guys are gonna go back home and have christmas <laughs> oh my gosh i have to take all this down <laughs> Yeah, there was no time before my move to de-decorate. I feel so far away here. from Christmas already, but... I know. A lot has happened. A lot has happened. That's my favorite wind. window, where yeah. Roger comes through the window. The Roger Rabbit Easter egg, yes. If you guys didn't know, right there, it looks like that's where Roger, Rab Roger Rabbit crashed through the window. Now time for our second show of the day. Indiana Jones! 
feels like it's been so long since I walked back in here. Like seriously so long. Probably, yeah, it was 2019. That's crazy to think about. We're in 2022 now. I'm so happy these shows are coming back. I don't think we've ever also walked through this like extended queue to get into the theater. Usually we just came like straight in the back. I love it back here, this is cool. Feels like we're in the jungle, which actually really makes me think of the Indiana Jones ride out in Disneyland, which I would love if that came here to Walt Disney World. Absolutely love it. Indiana Jones is one of like my favorite franchises. Like I love Star Wars, but I also really love Indiana Jones. I'm getting more and more into Star Wars all the time, but Indiana Jones was like the one that I enjoyed even before I watched all the Star Wars and everything. Jones out back. Once again, that is a modified version, just like Beauty and the Beast was, but 
it's just, it's coming back. That's what's so exciting. And the performers in that, I, I don't even know how they do those stunts. Like, they, everyone is just so talented. Okay, now we are heading out of Hollywood Studios and we have to go back. My car is over at Epcot, so we have to trek back there. And then tomorrow is actually the day that I check in for my Disney College program. So I have to get back and be well rested and everything. So we're kind of calling it a little bit of an early night tonight. So yeah, lots of exciting things happening tomorrow. Wish, helping make your visit to Epcot a truly international exchange.